Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Ruby. Um, I haven't made a video in quite a bit of time, so I'm back today with a new video. Um, today I'm just going to be making an applique shirt um, for my uh, aunt's daughter, which is my cousin, my baby cousin. Um, it's her birthday this weekend, and um, I made her some her birthday shorts already, which were some bummies. And now I'm going to be making a Marshall from Paw Patrol. Um, I bought the design off Etsy, and so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you guys the design really quickly. Give me one second. So this is the design I'm going to be making. Um, I need to just ch change the colors. Um, I'm going to be doing, since it's for a girl, I'm going to be doing the four in red glitter, the hat in red glitter, and then um, and the vest, and then just the rest white. So... And it's going to be applique. I might do, no, I'm not going to do the body in glitter. So, um, that's what I'm going to do. Give me one second while I fix my camera again. So, I'm going to start by arranging the colors. And, yeah. So, I'm just going to, oh, also, let me do an unboxing. Um, I got a package from AJ Blanks. And um, let me get my scissors. I got a package from AJ Blind. So let me show you guys that too. Hopefully, I don't tear anything in here. And then I also ordered um, some stuff from allstitch.com. That's where I get um, my um, pre wound bobbins for my, um, for my machine, my embroidery machine. And. Um, what else do I get from there? Oh, I get my pre wound bobbins from there. I get thread, the Madeira thread from there. And what else? I think that's it. So let's see what I got. What did I order? I forgot. Hold on, let me check. Mm. Oh, she put a um, thank you sticker on my order. I like it. I like the color. Thanks for supporting, supporting my small business. So guys, just for for your small business needs, want to see more? Oh, that's just like um her, I guess her second page. Um, so she had her website. She has kidscustomdesigns.com. On there, she sells fabrics and she sells um also some designs like number appliques and stuff. And then she has aging blanks, which is what I ordered. And then she has Angelina Jasmina. Angela Jasmina.com, which is her like merch stuff. So if you want to buy stuff in there. I got quite a bit of Fort Oh. I got some 4T shirt. Oh, 4T ruffle. Oh, I forgot I ordered. I should do it in this. I think I might do it on this. I bought a, some ruffle. Oh, I tore it. I bought some ruffle shirts from her. This is so cute. Look at this. It has little ruffles at the bottom and then it has the puff sleeves. Look at that. Look at that. That's super cute. Okay. So I bought that. More ruffles. 5T ruffles. 5T ruffles. Let me see what else I got. 5T ruffles. 6 ruffles. I'm going to make my daughter a shirt. 6 ruffles. My daughter's a size 6. And then I'm going to put them in here. Let's see what size 6 pink. I bought pink shirts. I like the pink shirts. Oh, you know why I got these shirts? The ruffle shirts, because she didn't have the uh, regular puff shirts in these sizes. She was all sold out. So I don't know when she's going to be doing like another restock. So here I got size 6 regular um, non-puff. My daughter's a size 6, and I'm kind of making her some stuff. I got 3T, 4T, 5T, 5T girls, and 6. And I'm going to show you where I keep all my... Um, all my um blank shirts i put them in this thing but they don't fit here i have fabrics lots of fabrics i'm always buying fabric i have a, a serious addiction and i have a lot more fabrics in there okay let me close it back up so i need to organize in there and yeah so oh and now let me show you my order from allstitch.com Hold on, let me fix my camera. Um, excuse me. Excuse me. There it goes. Now it looks weird. Hold on. Now you're too low. 
<laughs> Hold on, you guys. I'm so sorry. I'm a I'm total noob. Okay, let me show you guys. Okay, let me put this on the floor for now. One of these days, I want to get a big craft room. And look, I have like a mess. All oh, this is a mess. This I have like all right here. It's stuff I buy, and I just put it because I have nowhere to put it. I need to buy more shelf. I want to put shelvings on the like top. I don't know. I'll figure something out. Then I got a box. I had already opened this one from All Stitch. All Stitch don't come. I got it pretty fast. This one. I got the my pre one bobbins. I, these are the ones I use. Um, if you if you guys know what to do with the little magnet pieces of the bobbins, let me know because I don't know what to do with them. I just usually toss them, but I've seen people say to save them. So. I'm gonna start saving them. Oh, I don't even have to ask you guys. Look, it tells me right here what to do. It says core return. Sustainable practices today ensure it's a better tomorrow. Thank you for taking the time to save and recycle your empty clothes. Uh, details on how you can pursue any free core return program out here at the bottom of this box. Um, that's why, because there's nothing there. But it's probably like at the bottom of the box inside. Let me just check it out. Oh, yep. Yep, simply fill this box full of clap of what? Something, something, something. I don't know. Whenever I get to the end, I will read it and I will tell you guys. Just kidding. And then I ordered some threads. Um, I ordered like different shades of red because I want to get like every color in the book, which I have the I have the not the book, but they're um let me show you what I'm talking about. Let me show you what I'm talking about. I have this bad boy. And I want every single color of threads from this thing. Uh, uh, okay, I need to be more organized. Um, but yeah, I got a whole bunch of colors, different kinds of reds. Oh, you probably can't tell on camera, but yeah, you can actually. Let me turn this guy a little bit this way. You see? I got that one, and then I got this one, and excuse my nails, I haven't gotten them done. And then, oh, and then I also ordered more white because I ran out. And then I bought, like, this peachy colors because I want to do, like, skin tone stuff. But you can't tell. My lighting's bad. I got oranges because I'm a tiger. And uh, I want to use this like for carrots and stuff for Easter. So I got those in time. Another red. And then I got an extra white. It's somewhere in here. I don't know where. Oh, white. This is 1801. Yeah, 1801. And then I also got some um, 125 uh, sheets of 9 by 12. I believe this one is... This is Cutaway. Oh, I'll tell you right now. Oh, it's cutaway, but it's so soft, like you could tear it. That's cutaway. And oh, I lie. You know what? That that's tear away. This is cutaway. And then I got a package of cutaway. 125 of them. So that's all I got from all switch. Alright. Time to continue to make my shirt um i need to put these away in my little thread box so i keep all my threads for now we'll just throw them back in here anyways um i need i need storage ideas if you guys have any ideas for storage let me know because my room is really disorganized and i would like to reorganize i have some ikea desk but it's not enough i need like I don't know, I need I need stuff to put stuff away. And then you know what I like about all stitches is like in case you have like um Okay guys, here I did not know what I was talking about, so just ignore me. This is me, Ruby in the future. Actually no, this is supposed to be for this for this guy to send it back to the guy who sold it to him. So I guess they accidentally left it here. Oh well. To be associated. Yeah, because it's from to. I don't know. Anyway, so I guess let me start making the shirt 
and I will see you guys in a little bit. Okay, guys, I am back. I compl I completely forgot that I was filming. So, um, so far I did was HTV for the four tack down stitches, and I did white. This like glittery. You can't really tell on camera, but it's like a glittery white fabric here. Um, of course with heat and bond. So I'm gonna go put this back on the machine for the next steps, which I believe are the eyes and um, I don't know what else. We shall see, but I will be back. Okay, it's getting darker in my workspace, but I am almost done. This is what I'm doing. And let's clean out, look nice. So I used um, HTV for this, and then this I used fabric, and um, hopefully it comes out nice. Super excited. Um, if there's any other videos you guys would like for, to see me do, uh, or if you guys have any suggestions for videos, let me know. Um, I don't know what kind of videos to make. Oh, my camera, I have a really bad angle. Um, so yeah, let me know. Um, I did a kind of like an unboxing from Ostrich and um, from An uh, Angela. Just me. Oh, let me see. Are you upset? All right. So sorry, we got mail. Anyways, so yeah. So. If you guys have any suggestions for videos, let me know. Comment down below. Um, when the shirt's done, I'll come back. Um, I don't really like to make videos while it's, um, how do you call, working because it sounds really loud and you probably can't hear me. So, when the shirt is done, I will be back. We are on the home stretch, you guys. We are almost done. We are going to be doing, what's this? I don't know what this is. I'm so confused. Come on, zoom in. I mean, focus. I don't know what's next. I'm gonna do the name in red, um, so we'll see. All right, guys, I'm doing the name now. Um, so I, can't, I decided to do it in red. I was gonna do it in blue, but um, anyways, the black part that I didn't know what it was, it turned out to be the little black part of the, of the collar. I don't know if you can see, it has like a little black thing. Um, so that's what that was. But I'm almost done. For sure, for sure this time. And it was only 22,000 stitches. And there you go. Alright, as soon as I am done, I will come back. I said that two times already, but this time for sure when the shirt is done. And I put um, the... Um, what do you call it? Then this uh, tender touch, I will come back. <laughs> I never said anything again. Uh, so I'll be right back. And this is the shirt that I made with the little shorts. And um, as you can tell, um, it came out cute. Hey guys. So um, I finished the little outfit that I made. I'm um, sorry. Um, but I forgot to film. And I turned it in. I did get a picture of my little cousin wearing it, but I didn't get it complete. And what else? I did get I did get a picture of her wearing it. So I'll go ahead and insert the picture somewhere here so you guys can see it. And then I also made a little watermelon skirt, which I'm gonna make my daughter with this fabric. A little watermelon skirt. So I'm probably gonna film this this so I can make a video. I'm gonna do uh, applique with it as well for like a monogram on a shirt and then with the skirt it's gonna look super cute. Anyway, so we'll see how it comes out. Um, so that'll be my next video, I'm gonna film it right now. Um, literally it's been like a week since I last filmed that video so I feel so bad but it's okay. I'm gonna go ahead and upload it and then hopefully you guys like it and then I'm gonna videotape myself making this new um, little outfit for my daughter so thank you guys for watching if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and then also um, make sure you subscribe and um, yeah 
and if you have any suggestions for videos that you want to see um leave them in the comments maybe i can make a video maybe i don't know so something i don't know or if you guys want me to go live i can go live so i'm sorry i wasn't able to complete the video i feel so bad but i will get better at this youtube deal i definitely will thank you guys so much for watching bye I decided to add a picture of my kids here. Here, the one to the far left is my son Liam. The one in the back, yeah. tall one with glasses, is my son Adam. Well, and then my daughter is, is on the far right. And her name's Kira.